All right, so before we continue, I think we should practice some more clearing fractions on page seven. Uh, so right now we're just going to clear the fractions we're not going to solve. So uh, let's look at this example. You can see there's just one fraction. So can someone raise your hand and tell me what's the LCD? Uh, the LCD is just four. It's the least common denominator. It's just that one four. So again, everything has to get multiplied by four. So as we did in the last video, I'm going to put little fours above it here. Uh, and then can someone tell me what's the left side of the equation going to be? Uh, 8x minus 4. And then over here, what is this side going to clear out to be? 3x plus 36. Again, how did I do that? 3 times 4 is 12 divided by 4 is 3. We cross simplify and make these ones, and you still get 3x. Uh, one thing you'll see in some uh, equations, just this is just to show you that it's the same thing. So if you have 2x over 3, it's really the same as 2 thirds x. Same thing uh, if you have reverse it, uh, 1 half x, you could really just write that as x over 2. So if you turn the page, page 8, let's do this with. Uh, Two more, uh, three more examples here. Uh, so for example two, uh, what's the LCD between uh, three halves and nine halves? It's two. So we're gonna multiply everything by two. So put little twos above everything. And tell me, wanna tell me what the left side of the equation would be. Three W plus two equals the right side, two W plus Again, how did that happen? Uh, 3 times 2 is 6, divided by 2 is 3. Or cross simplify those and make 1s, and it's just there. Uh, 2 times 9 is 18, divided by 2 is 9. Or cross simplify those and make those 1s. Uh, number 3. All right, finally a different uh, LCD. What's the least common denominator between thirds and six? So right here, LCD equals 6. So now we're going to multiply everything by 6. So we'll put little 6 above. Okay. Uh, so who wants to clear this fraction for me? So you will get uh, 6 times an imaginary 1 is 6. Divided by 3 is 2x plus 6. And over here, what are you left with? 5x minus 18. All right, last one, number four. Again, just focusing on clearing these fractions. Uh, so this is a good example. What's the LCD between 4, 12, 3, and 6? Yep, that would be 12. So we're going to multiply everything by 12. If it helps, I'll put the assumed ones here and here. Uh, so what would the left side clear to be? This would be uh, 12 divided by 4, which is 3. So 3y plus uh, 1 equals 12 divided by 3 is 4y minus 12 divided by 6 is 2. All right, so hopefully this helps you clear some fractions. Uh, we'll continue to practice uh, coming up.